Hello? Ronnie, Ronnie, this is Mike. Mike Wong. How you doing, my guy? Hey, man. How you doing, man? I'm just chilling here in the NBA 2K uh, offices. Uh, you know, checking out some stuff. Checking over, uh, looking for some talent. Some people to drop some logos on. You know how that goes. Hey, well, real quick, man. I don't want to bother your day, but uh, could you do me a favor? I wanted to ask you something about the uh, NBA 2K21 shooting. Oh, uh, shooting? Shoot. <laughs> you see what I did there? Yeah, I see what you did there. Uh, check it out. Uh, I want to know, should we make it be like it was in previous uh, 2Ks and, and generations? Or should we make it just be hard as hell for no reason? Well, you know I'm always in favor of skill, so I say let's make it hard as hell for no reason. That way they'll have a reason to come to my stream on caffeine, because I'll be, I'm going to make a play shot. And I'm going to be the only one that can shoot the ball, and they'll wonder why. And uh, they'll have to come to me for things such as tips and such, and also realize that I am one of the truly elite in the community. All right, my guy. Hard as hell it is. Um, oh, well, did you need anything else? Nope, uh, that'll do it. I'll holler at you later. All right, Mike. See you next time. Three weeks later. Oh, did I do that? All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. I hope we were able to earn your like after that introduction. I worked a little hard on it, man, so you know it is what it is. 100 likes, we'll do it again. But anyway... NBA 2K21, that's a endemic going on. Parks is gentrified, and uh, it seems like we're part of a whole new generation. Get right, get left, get on, get lost, get in the bus, get dropped off. I don't know what's going on. We're going to talk about all that in a moment. So if you don't do anything else, make sure y'all like the video because 2K, I'm not 2K, I blame 2K for everything. YouTube links the likes to the notifications going out. So if you don't get enough likes, the notifications won't go out. That's why I'm asking y'all 400 likes. Other than that, let's get right into the video. Dino! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pipes, that shit made me upset. Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that head. Bro, let me tell y'all what, man. This whole Zen thing, I re I'm revisiting it. And I'm just thinking, don't y'all just imagine that conversation going like that with Ronnie and all those guys? Like, they just like, bro, just do it as hard and then we'll scale it back. Like, that's what they try to do every year. They make shooting difficult, then they scale it back, and they're like, you know, hey, we'll, we'll, we'll figure out something like this. But this time, I think they might have gone OD overboard. And the people using the Zen and things like that, that might be the proof of it. Never in any other 2K, like, look, look, we know that people have been using these Zens for years the Cronus Max the Zens all of that people used to use the Cronus Max in order to um get grind that guy at 99 for him in uh 2k what was that 19 um that's why they took up the little dots off the floor to where you couldn't wait to do your exercise you could just do exercise over and over and over and you could get you know people would use that joint to grind in 99 they've been doing that people will uh use the Cronus in order to just move that controller from one thing to another like I said I've got this $300 controller right here. I tried to get a Cronus to use it on my Xbox. I couldn't do it. So we know that they've been out there. So I just went and got this Xbox, not the Elite controller, but I, I went and got myself a uh, Power A controller or whatever, because I like it. Look, people been using it to play between Xbox and PlayStation and stuff like that all the time. Nobody knew it could cheat. So we know that these things have been out there. They've been a part of the 2K community forever, but nobody really used them other than to use a use a, um, a controller on another system. Along comes NBA 2K21. You can only shoot reliably a lot for a lot of people. They can't shoot. It does not matter what build they're using. They suck. They can't shoot. They out there shooting and just throwing up bricks like like all white bricks like Gucci Mane, Lafleur. They can't hit nothing. Nothing. They can't hit nothing. They out there, bro. I done showed y'all people with 95 three balls shoot 18, 20 percent, 20 percent. They shoot 18 percent. 30% people that I knew last year that were shooting over 60% shooting in the 30s this year. Why? Because 2K decided to make shooting ridiculously difficult. Now, let me ask you a question. If I see somebody shooting lights out and I realize that the only thing that separates me from shooting lights out like them, after I already put a $50 investment in the game to make this player that I wanted to play with because he plays how I wanted him to play, but he can't shoot no matter what I do, no matter how good I am, what's going to stop somebody that's willing to put a $50 investment in the game from making an $80 or $30 investment to get to get packed up 
so they can play the game at a higher level and make this player that I want to make viable. And then they realize they can do so much other stuff with it. Like I said, a lot of people already had this joint. It just is what it is. They want, they had this joint because they wanted to make it so they can move controller from system to system. And that's all they wanted to do. But then when you realize it can do, oh my goodness, it can do so much more, so much. Hey, what you gonna do, man? I am gonna tell you what it is. If I'm out there taking L's and stuff like that, I'm on the comp stage and I already got one of these joints and I see somebody come out there and they shooting lights out and I feel like this person is cheating, what you think I'm gonna do? Let me tell you the stakes of the comp stage. If you're in the comp, if you're in the comp stage and you stream the comp stage right, what's gonna happen? You get on the spot, you play. He who is on the spot or he who is on the court, they get the views. That's just how it goes. If you lose this game in the comp stage, what happens? Yeah, streaming the sideline for 20 to 30 minutes, my boy. Unless you can, unless you're one of those guys that's really, really good and you can get back on and you can play. Otherwise, you on the sideline with it for 20 to 30 minutes. Your stream might die. They already, Twitch already telling you you can't really play music and stuff like that. Why is this, it's just over for some of these people we're on the comp stage. So what they gonna do? We know what they're gonna do. This dude right here got this joint. Oh, that's what he's using. And he's standing on the court. And when he beats me, not only do people like people, this, ain't, this is not other communities. When you beat somebody off the court in the comp stage and they and, and they know you're cheating, you don't get shunned. People go to the stream like, I got to, I got to see what's going on there. I got to go in there and I got to see what's happening, man. I say, what's happening? Checking it out. Checking it out. Check, 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 check it out. Like, if you don't believe me, go and look at some of the people in comp stage that are known cheaters and are known to be cheating and how they doing. People are actually going to their streams to see what they're doing, to see if what they're doing is working and try to see if they can hop in there. So like if, if I'm in there and I'm out there sweating for that 250 VC, I mean that 750 VC or that 200, uh, that 2500 VC and I can't do nothing and you're beating me because you just made a, an additional investment, what you think people gonna do? Because it's gonna pay for itself because you're gonna get the viewers. And like I said, people, they love comp stays. I watch it all day long. It's like Daniels in the lines then. It's like watching American Gladiators. It's like watching ECW because it's like they're gonna use any means necessary or possible in order to win the game. You play to win the game. And that's what they gonna do. They don't care about none of that stuff. It ain't no honor amongst these. They don't wanna be on the sideline with it, streaming the sideline, sitting here saying, you know, and the only thing you can say is, dang man, this dude sucking. He, <laughs> he really got a Cronus or whatever like that. People really get tired of that and they be like, look, I'm just, I might as well just get me one. I even heard some, one streamer say today, bro, this game is boring unless you got a Cronus and that actually make it fun. And he's streaming comp stage right now. How can, how does cheating make a game fun? I don't get it. This whole 2K community. <laughs> this whole 2K community is just, it's just backwards. How does cheating make the game fun? I grew up in a generation, in a generation where is they said, cheating takes the fun out of the game. Unless it's that Grand Theft Auto code where you get all the weapons and you get like, you can't be hurt because some of those missions you need it. Or if it's uh, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, BA, BA, start. Or if it's uh, 00737395636. Uh, unless it's those, cheating, like, cheating is just, it just takes the fun out of the game. But this dude was audacious enough to say, bruh, the only reason, the only reason to play this game would be like if you got a Zen because it makes the game fun. What? How trash do you have to be to be like, I'm gonna cheat? to feel like I'm better than other people, and that's what makes the game fun for me. Hey, it is what it is, man. We know that the 2K community is full of a lot of a lot of lames. I mean, this is what it is. But like I said, in the case of the comp stage, I kind of get it, because if you're beating me by cheating and you're messing with my money, then why wouldn't I just say, you know what? Let's just put it on the same playing field. So if we all cheating, then is anybody really cheating? I don't know. I get it though, because I don't want to be out there streaming the damn sidelines for 30 to 40 minutes at a time and I can't get picked back up and the only reason I'm off the court is because somebody wanted to come out here and cheat. It just is what it is. But, you know, I, I don't know, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section because I digress. If that was your life, if life, your life was comp stage, would you do that? And is it really, whose fault is this really? 
Is it 2K's fault for making shooting too difficult because we never had this problem before, but we know that people had Zens and Cronus matches and stuff like that. We know that they had it, but this has never been a problem before. And people been scripting the button forever. I know. I done seen people, I done been in the wreck and seen people on my team and they make the same movement before they shoot the ball and stuff like that every single time. We know that they've been out there. But I think that this is the first time that people ever felt like they really, really needed to use it. People probably had it in the tuck and been like, I ain't gonna use that joint. And then now they're just like, bro, I got to use it because I, I'm not gonna keep taking L's to lesser people. And it's really messing with my money because he who is on the court, they got the views no matter how trash they are. And if they're cheating, people aren't walking away from it. They are actually flocking to the stream. Like what? Am I, I don't know, man, it is what it is. But y'all let me know what y'all think now in the comment section. I'm having a ball with it, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. I like watching these guys go at each other in the cheesiest manner possible. And I'm not gonna lie. It is entertaining as hell when you know somebody got his in and they literally are sitting there trying to stop this guy. <laughs> you know they can't stop it. And the only thing they can say is, if I wanna keep playing in this joint, if we're not gonna boo people off the court and we're not gonna stop people <laughs> <laughs> doing it i might as well get me one hey god dang that's what everybody else said man i even i heard a few people say it yesterday man just like bro if, if they're not gonna stop it and it's not cheating and you can't get banned for it i might as well get one too and i feel it i'm just like i'm not gonna do it because it ain't that serious to me i make funny content my whole channel is based around me being trash but if it was based around me being good and all of a sudden i couldn't shoot and i couldn't do the things i used to be able to I might consider it. Anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Is it 2K fault? Are people lame as hell for cheating? I think they lame as hell for cheating, don't get me wrong. But it is entertaining as hell to watch. I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, and uh, but I really feel like it, 2K, they ain't innocent in this. I think they really do take some um some part in this whole thing. That is how I feel. I'm gonna holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh <laughs> from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Gosh, please, gosh, please.